sailing in the Chesapeake Bay on a 22 ton catch. We are testing the high current controller driving a hydraulic pump. The autopilot is in apparent wind mode. The Nomeo wind data arrives to open plotter below. It is then sent over Wi-Fi to the autopilot as well as a Windows tablet. The hydraulic motor uses about 150 watts. In these conditions, it averages only 5 watts, most of the time not moving. The controller is mounted in an anodized aluminum box for good heat sinking. In this test, the controller only warmed by 1 degree Celsius after a few hours. The raspberry with the compass sensor should be mounted away from the controller to prevent the current carrying wires from distorting the compass reading. An optional rudder feedback sensor measures the rudder position. This is simply a variable resistor or potentiometer. Virtually any rudder feedback sensor can be used by changing the resistor values inside the controller. The rudder feedback stops the rudder at end of travel before the overcurrent detection that is usually triggered from stalling the motor and reduces stress on the pump and ramp. The rudder angle is reported to OpenCPN and displayed in the dashboard.